Hello and welcome to Royal Vibes. Desperate Harry and Meghan at loggerheads with Netflix after wanting to delay controversial docu series. So guys, before we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe if you haven't, give the video a like, and please watch the video right up to the very end. Prince Harry and Meghan are reportedly at loggerheads with Netflix chiefs over their controversial docu series. The TV giant is insisting it is broadcast in early December as planned despite the successes wanting a delay. Netflix reportedly wants to show the series after the fifth season of The Crown, which is hugely popular in the US. There is also some concern over its content. We revealed last month that Harry was trying to make late edits to his £35 million book in the wake of the Queen's death. Sharing parts were insensitive and needed refining. It emerged yesterday that makers of the Netflix show say some of Harry's comments in the book are at odds with those he has made on camera. A source told the New York Post that a lot in the show contradicted what Harry has written in his book, so that was an issue. Then Harry and Meghan made significant requests to walk back content they themselves have provided for their own project. Harry and Meghan are set to discuss other royals including King Charles, Camilla and Prince William on the program, directed by top US documentary maker Liz Gabos. Sources late, late, um, said late edits were unwelcome as it needs translating into other languages. One explained that Netflix needs a couple of months to do all of the formatting and dubbing, subtitling and audio, the stuff that enables it to launch. The Californian-based couple have previously leveled racism accusations at the Royals, but The Sun told last week how they hoped for a reconciliation after the book and series come out. They avoided criticizing the Queen, but it is feared that they could have aimed baps at Charles and Camilla before the, he became king. Royal author Angela Levin said, I am not surprised that they have found contradictions because you cannot trust what Harry and Meghan say. Meghan has her truth. And Harry is also too weak to contradict her, even going along with the claim that they had their wedding three days before the real thing in their opera Winfrey. I think they may be worried about criticism of Charles and Camilla because they have seen how popular they are, with thousands and thousands lining the streets around the Queen's funeral. So guys, with that we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye bye.